Hey everybody, how's it going? It's your man here, Kid 5 and I am back for our very first installment of a new Pokemon game that we're going to be playing live on my Twitch channel. And we're live on Twitch right now. Um, obviously, when you're watching this, it won't be, but we're going to be starting a new game called Pokemon Fable, the very first Pokemon game on stream. So, hopefully you guys are hyped, and if you are watching on YouTube, make sure to hit that like button. Of course... Subscribe if you guys have not on YouTube. Um, I am also on Twitter, as you can see on the screen. Um, and I'm currently streaming this live on Twitch, for those of you who are obviously wondering. Um, Twitch.tv slash Caterade 5. Make sure to drop a follow there, because um, who knows? I might be live with some more Pokemon Fable or Overwatch or any type of content that you guys may... Um, be interested in but anyways we're gonna go ahead and click enter we're gonna start this game actually real quick let me go into options um i mean i guess my music is low enough to where like it's not gonna be a problem to have these at 100 but normally i set these down just a little bit um we're gonna have fast tech speed battle effects running keys hold yes speech frame yeah, okay, I think they made, yeah, they definitely made, um, custom frames, just, like, one custom frame for each, so I'm gonna keep it like that. Um, you already know your boy likes the fire red leaf green, um, screen size, and we'll keep it at medium. I'm not really too mad about that. Screen border, if it's on, it's literally just that, and that messes up the whole screen, so you guys don't want to see that. <laughs> Alright, so, let's go ahead. Oh, for a second I thought it like stayed like that on stream. I'm like, whoa. No, no, it's not. All right, let's go ahead. Go into a new game. <clears throat> the world of Pokemon. It's truly a magical place. What stories have you heard? What fables? Many know of the tales about a boy from Palatown, or how one person's efforts saved an entire region from destruction. However, what of the stories from the past? Today, I'd like to tell you the story of... Oh, okay. Oh, this is a female, alright? So, I could do Cade. I could do everybody's favorite word to call me when, they, when I was like 10. Cade, as like a girl name. I'm just gonna do Cade, though. You know what? I don't care. I... Sure. I could just do my sister's name, but whatever. Our story today. Cade's story begins in the quiet daybreak village. Oh, alright. Cade, there you are. I've been looking for you all day. Where have you been? Well, anyways, do you have any orn berries today? Oh, wonderful. Here you go. Ooh, 600 buckaroos. Lovely. Thank you very much. Sorry, Cade. I know you live in the forest. It's just... Please be careful on your way back today. I'm not sure if you've heard, but there have been strange happenings as of late in that forest. People hear strange noises, things going missing during the night. It's probably nothing, but I do worry about a girl of your age in the forest all alone with just your grandmother. This is so weird because I'm watching it like on the game screen and on, on like OBS too. It's kind of creepy, dude. Whatever. Um, we don't want anything bad happening to you, do we? I'm just making sure. Okay, I'm just making sure I'm not dropping any frames. Okay. Well, take care, Cade. All right. Well, that's that. What's this? A blue apricorn. What Pokemon do we have? We have a level 20 Skitty. Interesting. Now, hopefully you don't have to grind in this game. I haven't heard any complaints about grinding, so that's a good sign. Well, let's go ahead and see. We have Heal Power, Energy Powder, Red Apricorn, Blue Apricorn. Catching my Pokemon is more effective than a... Okay, so Apricorns are used for catching my Pokemon. Alright. Um, we have one. Let's get four in our bag. Hopefully that's decent. Um, 
What's this? Status, okay. Um, apparently these do actually, like, you know how they, in normal games, they normally, like, reduce health of your Pokemon? I think they do, you know, I just completely forgot that this dude was here. Anyways, he's just got cheap stuff that actually I could probably buy. I'm gonna buy two citrus berries. I'm not about to do that, but maybe later. You're here. Is there anything interesting today? No? Are we okay? There's nobody here. What do you have to say for yourself, buddy? Village market is great. I can get everything I need without having to risk going into the forest. It's a low blow to forest roamers that like me, I guess. Live in the forest, that must be pretty scary at night time. So, obviously the theme is the forest is scary at night. Living out here is peaceful, but you are pretty cut off from everything. Hmm. Hmm. I love wandering to the opening of the forest during springtime to hear the fletchling chirping. It sounds so happy. Alright. Um, sure. Sure, dude. Technology is incredible. Can you believe we can store Pokemon in Apricorns? I wonder what conveniences the future will hold. No, actually, I remember. So this game is actually, um... This game is, is actually like the power we hold where there were not Pokeballs before this. Now, I don't know if this story has to do with the creation of Pokeballs, like the power we hold did. But, um... And it's interesting. What do you have to say, my good friend? Uh, there are lots of wild Pokemon lurking out in the forest. I'd love to go and meet some, but it's way too dangerous without a Pokemon of my own. Hmm. City dwellers. Come on. Actually, what's this? A miracle seed. I like how they switched the item ball around. I think that's kind of cool. Uh, this forest is eons old. Older than any human and older than even most Pokemon, too. Hmm, interesting. So far, this is the one thing that I really like um, Don Bronze games, which, by the way, I should definitely give credit to the creators of this game, Don Bronze, the, um, the main head of this game, and also to Dio and Aki. Aki? I think it's Aki. Um, for help on this game, I guess. Um, so yeah. I already talked to this dude? Oh, um, maybe. Yeah. Just making sure you know that we haven't missed anything. Um. But yeah, what I was gonna say is, um. Is that he has like these, um. These like updated, like updated Gen 3. So it's all Gen 3 themed. So you really don't have to change, like, these NPCs and stuff. Like, they look really, um, it looks just really clean. Like, obviously he made these himself. Uh, like, you can see, like, kind of the darkish area. I think that's really cool. Anyways, it's time to go on to the forest trail. And this was the theme early in the game, so that's interesting. We'll have to see whether, um... This hap this um what happens here. So anyways, uh we found three Pecha Berries. Um I might as well give a Pecha Berry to um my good friend um Skitty. Um Because I mean what else is it gonna use? Actually never mind, I have orange berries, so I might as well give that to her. Or it. I mean I didn't know that Skitty didn't have a name. Um, what's this? I don't know. What Pokemon are in this grass, though? And there's not... Okay, there's a Fletchling. Oh, this uses EBS! Alright, that's, that's interesting. I already have some, um... Um... Stuff. We already have some experience, should I say. And, um... This is really interesting. It really is. 
Sorry, I keep playing with the audio controls. Um, I mean, we might as well try and catch a Fletchling. You know? I mean, we have the capacity to. I believe um, if we do attack it again, we should be able to keep it alive. All right. Let's go to big Pokeballs and a... No, let's use a red apricorn because they're easier or like less effective I guess you know what I mean one two three there we go fletchling was caught all right I think that's cool would you like to give a nickname to fletchling no I'm not gonna nickname any of these mons just because obviously skitty doesn't have a nickname so why should any of our other Pokemon have nicknames if we can't nickname Skitty. That makes any sense. Um, hopefully though, I'm not going to be going back here too often. Um, but, if that needs to happen, I guess it'll happen. I guess that'll happen, but whatever. For now, um, like we have... I really like the, um, I read, um, the music from Fire And we also have a new youngster sprite, which I think is really cool actually. Um I probably could have used um fake out there. Um but I guess it doesn't really matter. I believe this should take out the fletchling. No it doesn't. Um I'll just disarming voice this thing. Um I don't really know which is better at this point because obviously Skitty is not a fairy type. Um so yeah, it's interesting. We're getting some nice experience though. Youngster Benjamin is down for the count. So there we go, there's that. Um Yeah, we're running into more Pokemon. We have ourselves the Shroomish, actually, which I think I'm definitely going to catch. Um just because um we do have a miracle seed. Um, I take back not, um, naming anything, because I'm definitely going to name this Shroomish. Um, jeez, that gets him quite a bit of health back, actually. Er, I'm not going to do that, but we're going to switch out into our good little pal Fletchling here. Um, just so we don't have Leech Seed happening. Of course, it seeds us anyway. Alright, that's annoying. Um... Get so much HP back as well. However, I do believe we do have Pack here. It should be doing quite a bit of damage to Shroomish. Um, but I think with this Mega Drain um, and Leech Seed, um, it should be able to survive another one. Um, hopefully. If not, that would be unfortunate. We'll see. Okay, easily it does. Um, so, it is going to get some HP back from Leech Seed, however, I think that we're um, going to be able to catch this. Um, not go to party, let's go to Bag, and let's go to Pokeballs, and let's go to um, a Red Africa. Actually, I should probably... There you go. I'm just trying to update the stream name so you, I'm not misleading people. Um, would you like to give a nickname to Shroomish? Um, yes, because I have a nickname for Shroomish. There we go. Toadstool. Oh, probably shouldn't be doing that. Um, oh, let's go back to the Pokemon Center as much as I would love to continue on. I think we should probably heal up our Mons. You know? Just have them in tip-top condition. I don't think we're probably going to use Fletchling in this playroom now. In this playthrough now. I'm um, probably just, um... Shroomish. Um... We're going to give the Miracle Seed to Toadstool. Um... And another thing is, like, I feel like I could solo run this game with Toadstool. I mean, Skitty. Not Toadstool. Um... 
but yeah, Fletchling will just put him back to the party. Because uh, we're not going to use it. I feel like Fletchling is too common of a Pokemon to be used. Um, let's go ahead and... Alright, we have another Wild Encounter. And this time, yet again, it's a Fletchling. Hopefully we can run from this thing, because I'm not trying to be packed right now. Thank you. Forgot that. Obviously, that's there. Um, have ourselves another blue apricorn. Um, is there anything this flower? Probably not. Uh, that's what I thought. Alright, is there anything over here? No. Alright, let's just go up here. Oh, crap. Holy... That's a Keldeo. Um... What a strange Pokemon. It doesn't look familiar at all. It's very clearly upset. Whoa. No, 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 no. You're gonna get killed. What the heck? The Pokemon nuzzled you. It seems to be friendly towards you. It seems to have calmed down a little now, too. Maybe Grandma will recognize what Pokemon this is. Are you... It looks willing to... What? We just got a level 20 Caldeo. Whoa! Is that the the Sam the Sandwich Salesman in the in the chat? Dude, do I have to get out my goggles? Do I have to get out my goggles and see that Sam the Sandwich Salesman is in the chat? We just got a Keldeo. Holy crap! Shane the Pokemon's, yeah, dude. Um, yeah, we were just gifted a level 20 um, Keldeo. I'm guessing they give you which Pokemon they want you to use in this playthrough. Oh, what? Yeah, we're playing Pokemon Fable. This is like a shorter game that uh, was made for the Relic Castle Game Jam. I'm just getting around to playing some of these games now, so might as well play it. Cadio, let's stop. Please stop. Um, but uh, let's see here, dude. I'm one win from 1300 too. <laughs> if that makes any sense. Um, should no, 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 absolutely not. Um, let's see here. Um, I actually have to uh, take a very quick break to check my blood sugar. Yes, I have a Keldeo and a Skitty. I kind of want to solo run this game with Keldeo. Oh, um, I mean, if. I don't know. I don't know how long I want to play this. This Pokemon seems to be on edge. Oh, Keldeo will follow me? Wait, can Skitty follow me? Oh no, it's literally just Keldeo. Only Keldeo. I mean, I'll, as I said, I'll probably play a little bit later. Um, but anyways, what's, what's down here? I know we're trying to find our grandma. What's over here? There has to be something over here. Come on. Really? No? Come on. Oh, what's this? This is sparkling. Comforting glow. Oh, that heals. What items? What What do you mean, what items? I don't get what you mean. I. It's five loot boxes. I, you're talking about Overwatch. Like, if you're wondering, like, what you get. Is this our grandma? Um, who is this? Hmm. Uh, who is this fine feller here? For goodness sake, the blessed thing must be around here somewhere. Whoa. Haha, <laughs> there you are, you little beast. Ah, little girl. What are you doing with this Pokemon? Where did you ever find it? No, that doesn't matter. Just hand it over to me now. There's a good girl. Pay no attention to it, but it- oh. 
It's but a wild beast. It has no idea what it's doing. Now, hand it over to me. The Pokemon looked at you with pleading eyes. What items are on your Pokemon? Oh. I have an Ornberry on Skitty and a Miracle Seed on Shroomish. And nothing on Keldeo or Fletchling. I'm not going to be using Fletchling. And nothing on Keldeo. Which I probably should put an Ornberry on Keldeo, but you know what? At this point, it's too late. The Pokemon looked at you with pleading eyes. Listen here. I am Jonathan Grimm. That Pokemon is Keldeo. I desire that Keldeo for my personal collection. I am what you might call a Fable Hunter. And if you won't hand it over willingly, I'm more than happy taking it by force. Oh crap! Fable Hunter Jonathan wants to battle. And he's got a mighty Aina. Wow. Oh crap, that's kind of a high level. Just kind of a high level, dude. Holy crap. Please tell me that Keldeo has a fighting type move. Okay, catch this fake out, boy. Real quick. Real quick, like. Boom. That did absolutely nothing. We do have Disarming Voice, which is a special move. Um, sure. Ah, yo. I don't know if they changed, like, this animation, too. Yes, I'm okay with Skitty going down real quick. Let me say that. What do you want, Pump? I literally just entered a blood trigger for you. Alright, I thought I had this all settled and over with. Apparently freaking not. By the way, I'm like super high right now, dude. Like, high blood trigger. Come on now. Don't let your mind go into the gutter, you guys. I know what you were thinking. I know what every one of you were just thinking. And you guys have dirty minds. <laughs> oh, guy. Why does this have to happen? Hopefully, I'll be willing to, um, like, actually edit this. No, I just calibrated my sensor. I already bolused. Point to... Okay, boy. See, this is what happens to me, like... Three times a night, dude. Alright, let's go ahead and disarm your voice. Snarl. Did you just get give me another alert? I literally just oh my god, I literally just entered a freaking blood sugar. Screw you, Pump. I'm not actually doing that because that's what they tell you to do. Okay, snarl. Down goes Skitty. And there we go. Alright. Well, I'm gonna pull out my secret weapon now. Hopefully this thing's got a fighting type move, because if not, I'm kind of screwed. Um Oh yes, it's got a double kick. Thank god. Die. Just die. Does that not kill? Oh it does. Alright, there we go. We take those. Bye bye, mighty Anna. Like, there's no way we could have won that battle without Kelly. Well, what impossible! Bah, you're free for now, you little beast. But don't you ever think you're safe from me. I'm gonna have a small guess that he is the main antagonist. Keldia looks ready to go again. Onwards to Grandma's house. Okay, well, I guess they clearly put this rock here, you know? Why is Snarl doing damage? Does Snarl, I don't know. Does Snarl do damage? Like, I know Snarl's a trash move. That's all I know. 